What's up, YouTube? This is your man, Big B Production 100. I have a great video for you guys today. Today, in this short video, I'll be showing you guys how to see if you have bad memory installed in your Mac. Now, some of the things you want to look for when you have bad memory installed in your Mac and you may not know it. Number one, your videos may take a little longer to play. Your video games may take a little longer to render when you're trying to play them. Applications may close at times unexpected, or they may take a little longer to load when you're trying to install them or when you're trying to open one up. Let's just say to just open up iBooks to read one of your books on your Mac. It may take a little time. Now that we have that out of the way, you know what to look for when you have bad memory installed. Let's learn how to check your memory. You just want to come up to the left hand corner where it's got the Apple symbol at. Come down to where it says about this Mac. Once you do so, you will then be presented with this. Okay, you'll see here that I have memory, my processor and all that good stuff. Now that we know how to check to see what type of memory we have installed, now only thing you have to do is simply hold down your option key and the letter D on your keyboard once you restart your Mac. When you restart your Mac, you'll hear a charm sound. You will then hold down the option key and D. When you hear the second charm, you'll release those keys and you'll be presented with the test memory screen like so. When you run this application that's already installed on your Mac, it will then check your memory if it finds any faulty memory, it will let you know right then and there on the screen. If not, you'll see something like this, which indicates that everything is fine. So I hope this video was very informative for you guys. If so, please rate, comment, and subscribe for your man. It really helps me out a lot. I'll let you.